good morning children already we discussed the first lesson that is plant based production again i uh, recap for you the revision for you for this lesson what we have discussed see most of the plants produces from seeds only isn't it so what is the reproductive part of a plant flower the flower grows into a fruit inside the fruit you get a seed what is a seed a small object from which a new plant grows is called a, is known as seed is it so already we discussed you eat different fruits isn't it in our day to day life or seasonal fruits some fruits have only one seed some fruits have many seeds some fruits have few seeds so which uh, which fruits have many seeds watermelon is there papaya is there or uh, you can say tomatoes there many seeds you will get in this fruits single seed mango is there plum is there lychee is there only one seed is present in the same way few seeds are also there very few seeds three four seeds or five seeds will be there in some fruits so what are they apples or you can uh, take the example of sapota only few seeds you get in these fruits okay now in your surroundings you will see many plants are there can you name the plants which you see in at home also or in your surroundings also while coming from house to school also you will see many more plants what are the different plants you see in your surroundings or at home which plants are there name tree will be there ashoka plants will be there is it and mango plants will mango trees will be there isn't it many plants you will see apart from this all people also you will see people plant also there so many more plants you will see in your surroundings now coming to how the reproduction takes place from the seed what is a what is reproduction the process by which an organism either plants or animals produces its own kind is known as reproduction produces its own kind means what you understand by this mango seed when you plant it in the soil you will get mango plant mango plant only isn't it tomato seeds tomato plant only isn't it or like this you whatever seeds you will plant it you will get same plant only so what is reproduction a process by which an organism whether plants or animals produces its own kind is known as reproduction is it it we have discussed this now here coming to the structure of a seed also we discussed now seed what are the conditions required to grow a seed what are the favorable conditions are required to grow a seed to germinate a seed the seed should be healthy the first and foremost thing is the seed should be healthy is it a good soil soil is very important and warmth is required is it a minerals are required isn't it good healthy seeds are required proper amount of soil is required and warmth is required air water and water is required these are the conditions required to germinate the seeds isn't it already we discussed now what are the now see what are the parts of a seed this also we discussed isn't it what are the parts of a seed now coming to the structure of a seed coming to the structure of a seed here you are seeing this this is called the fleshy leaves here the outermost covering of 
PC is called a seal coat, which protects the inner parts of the seal. Isn't it? These are called fleshy leaves, which is stores the food for the growing embryo. Fleshy leaves, isn't it? And this part is called the embryo. Baby plant. These are the parts of the seed. These are the parts of the seed. Isn't it? So now, how many types of seeds are there? There are two types of seeds. That is, dicot and monocot seeds. Dicot seeds, two cotyledons are present. Monocot seed, only one cotyledon is present. Example of dicot seed, I showed you bean seed. Bean seed, chickpea. Isn't it? These are the examples. Two cotyledons are present. What is the function of the cotyledon? It stores the food for the seedling. New plant. Isn't it? And so, Monocot, mono means only one cotyledon is present. Rice, maize, jawar, bajra, corn, isn't it? These are called monocotyledonous plants. Okay, children? Understood, children? So, here you have to draw the structure of a seed in your textbook. Also, passage is given for you for drawing. Drawing. Okay? Thank you, children. Have a nice day.